Mark, again, you should have won perhaps, but in the end could have lost. Yeah, I'm, I'm pleased for obviously the team and the supporters that they, they stuck with us and we managed to get that goal. You know, we didn't want to be talking about not scoring. We've had numerous chances today. John Marcus looks a real threat every time he got in the box. We've hit the bar a couple of times, the keepers made a few good saves. Frustrating that they scored the goal that they did, but we knew that's what they were planning. You know, the plan was to sit and defend. But I think the key to it is the tempo that we started with was excellent for 25 minutes. And then the tempo when we scored, when they scored for the last 25 minutes, that was what we should be about. And um, that's going to win us games, not, not that middle bit when it becomes pretty even and, and we just we just come off slightly what we're what we're good at doing and what we what we do best and and then, then we allow teams just to get something in us today that, that, that we shouldn't have allowed today. You made a decision to make the change in formation. What was the thinking behind that? Well, Stevie wasn't Stevie wasn't fit and I just felt with one up top playing against that it was the right way to go. We, we wanted to get another body forward. It didn't work as well as I obviously would have wanted, but there were some 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 good bits. Um, I'm just, just delighted we've managed to get something out of it. I think it's the least we deserve. But, you know, goal was, the goal we conceded was disappointing. Uh, and it's not often this season you've had to say that? No, 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 we haven't. One, one ball from a throw in right in front of the dugout. Um, and we got caught out, you know, we know what James is about. It was a great finish for him. And it looked like it was going to settle the game. But we, to be fair to the lads, credit to them. You know, the subs come on and made an impact. Zach. Zach was excellent. Joe Anks got the goal. Terry, part, you know, build up for the goal. Uh, and we, the good thing is we kept pulling away. We didn't lose spirit. We didn't, we didn't give up. And although we didn't win the game, you know, points better than getting beat. So, you know, we, we can dust ourselves down now and, and go again next Saturday. And, and psychologically, how important is it not to get beat? Because you had a great start yep. and a couple of yep. backs, yep. and, and, and today could have been just a third one there. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So it's, it's, as you said, psychologically very important. You know, we, when we, when we, the one thing we, when we've been good in games, the one thing that we've had massively is, is energy and tempo. And, and I just felt the middle bit just drifted a little bit, really. And we didn't quite, you know, we're all, we're all waiting for that goal. We're all waiting. Someone's waiting. Someone's got to go and make it happen. You know, someone's got to go and tap one in from two yards, follow something up, anticipate something and, and then we're not, we're not talking about it. We can't become fearful of it and, and Anxi showed and to be fair, to be, you know, the lads showed at the end, you know, the last 25 minutes and, and the first, that when we do that, no, people won't be able to live with us. We get chances, we, we've got people who have that desire to score, whoever it is and, and the attitude within the squad is really pleasing, just, just a little bit disappointed that we only got a point out of the game but that said, you know, there's a couple of minutes to go and we're losing one now, so credit to the players for that. What, what's the situation regarding Lagos now? John Marcus is coming to us. John, yeah, yeah, John will be st staying um, and then we'll, we'll go from there. John will be staying, we're, looking for, we're obviously looking at bringing a couple of players in if we can and we'll, we'll see where we are with Jordan. Uh, and what, what's the situation with new players? How, how soon do you think we might be able to get them out? We've got, we've got loads of games Monday, we've got a, a couple that I'm after. Um, I said we'll just see what comes over the next couple of days. And you asked me about you know, it's a bit straight after this game. I've got nothing to report at the moment. You know, we're doing what we can to bring something in. You know, we know we're a little bit light up front, but hopefully that will be addressed this week. Uh, the other thing that's really pleasing is the crowd stayed with you, didn't they? Oh, the crowd was superb. Yeah, and, and at the end they appreciate the lads. I just want to give them more. We want to give them so much more, but. You know, little mistakes, whoever they are, you know, today, the goal, um, you know, chances that we're not creating. That, we don't want to create that fear factor here where, where we're fearful of playing at home. And, and, you know, that's not the case. The supporters have been magnificent. At the end, clap the players off for their efforts. And, and that's what we want. And, and, and I really appreciate it. And I know, I know the players do as well. And, and, and you're saying one mistake, but I mean, Trev Tra Carson made a couple of good saves yeah. in the first half. But other than that, he's yeah. not really had much to do. No, and that, that's the dis that's why we're disappointed that we've not, you know, won the game. But listen, sometimes you do that. You go to places and have to defend. And well, I just felt we didn't didn't quite do enough to get that that first goal and second goal. And I think if we get the first one, I think we go and 
win the game, but if buts and maybes don't don't win you things, you know we have to be ruthless. We have to just someone has to go and take the chances that are coming on because we we created plenty, and I, and then all the games bar bar second half against Southend when when we. We didn't really, you know, bar that, we've created games and chances in every single game that we've played and I understand it can be frustrating that we're not scoring but as long as we create the chances, as long as we get in there, just someone will eventually start putting them in the back of the net. Right, thanks mate. Cheers, Pete. How, how important do you think it is just to, to get a goal, however it Massive, came? yeah, massive, massive. Um, and I thought it was well deserved but it was, um, we needed it, we, we, we didn't need to go a fourth game, and I don't think we deserve to go a fourth game. You know, we, we played some really good stuff, and, and in all the games, that, like I say, far south end second half, we have created chances. We don't want to make it, a, you know, a bit of a stigma. We don't want to make it like that, but you know, it's it's time for people to stand up, and we ask them to be counted. Whether it's you know, normally it's up for the defenders and putting blocks on the line, it's being brave in their box, being anticipate things, little tappings. Um, and, and I thought John Marcus was a real threat, but we didn't have too many others, you know, desperate to score that goal, you know, and, 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 we, and we need it. Yeah, if he carries on playing like he has been, surely the goal's going to come from Arsenal. Oh, away, without away doubt. Away. I have, oh, yeah, his, his work rate is phenomenal. Um, he leads the line really well for us. And I, and I thought Byron did well today, but we just got to get him scoring goals. And we're creating for him. It's just getting that first one, getting that next one. I think once we get that. Next week at Burton, then, then hopefully it will, it will go okay. Yeah, Byron, do, do you think he might be lacking a bit of confidence at the moment? Or I don't know, you'd have, listen, you'd have to ask him. I, I don't think his general play warranted that. You know, I, I can say that about him. I thought he was he was really good, but just we just couldn't, we just, we just didn't, didn't create him, to be fair, any clear cut chances. But sometimes, you know, we've been working on him about him getting in himself in better positions. He's been a little bit more, he does great for the team. He's a big focal point of what we try and do. Maybe we need to create a few more things for him. And he needs to put himself in positions where we're laying things on a plate for him rather than him having to think he has to go and make things for himself. So, you know, still plenty of work to be done, but we always do that. Yeah, first league start full black in midfield. Actually. Yeah, he did all right, yeah, he did really well. Give us a little bit of balance and energy. And obviously once we, once we conceded, I just felt we had to, had to do something slightly different, so we did that. I thought Zach, Zach looked superb, real a real threat. Um, Anxi come on with his with his energy and his willingness to get on the ball, and obviously a, a great goal for us. And, and Terry come on, and we've got people who can make a difference. We just got to make sure that that, that that everyone just keeps focused and, and just keeps doing what we're trying to do. Yeah, Lee Vaughan, the only sort of started training Thursday, didn't he? Did really great, did, did really Thursday. good, really good. Really pleased with Lee, and it's good to have him back in the family. Yeah, brilliant. All right.